Hi, this is Delicious again. Welcome to another review which will be a bit different from the Russian reviews. However, as you can see, it has a lot of common with Russians. I got this idea after my review of the new Ukrainian army and a friend of mine uh, just asked what would happen if I try to boil an egg with using the famous Russian heater. So, we will have now a duel, a competition of three different FRH with this middle sized X. We have here a standard regular US MRE FRH. This is a true tech FRH which comes with the Canadian Russians and I have one pouch left. This is this Ukrainian 2018 new Flemish Russian heater and the heating pad. Because these are really different items, so this one comes from 2014 and this is 2015. So to give them a bit better chance, I will add a bit of salt to both of them and this will remain as it is. I'm going just to put this egg into the Flemish Russian heater and uh, let it stand for let's say 15 minutes all of them. I try to use uh, something, some helpful isolation, this sleeve for this US one. I have just empty bag for the Canadian one and this Ukrainian is so powerful devil that I will leave it as it is. Let's prepare our competitors. Start with the Canadian. Just a quick check how long should it be heated. 12 minutes and leave it flat. These eggs were in the fridge so they are cold, so I'm interested how it will look like. Now the US one. This is very tight. Yeah, but the managed to do this and now I have to open the pouch and we are almost ready to go they are starting to boil this Ukrainian one is steaming oh my gosh and also the UK, uh, US one is also uh, full of steam and this Canadian, I don't know, I guess it works as well. So these two are on the angle, US and Ukrainian and the Canadian is laid flat. So let's wait and we'll see. Okay, our eggs are hot. They were in the famous Russian heaters for 20 minutes and I am very curious. This is from the US, this is from the Canadian and this is Ukrainian. This, the, la the last one, uh, I, I don't know how it looked like because these two uh, FRH are small so these eggs actually were lying on this heating pads and the Ukrainian is very big so it was lying just bes beside. Or maybe it will be raw. Okay, I will peel now these eggs and we'll cut them and check. So these are the results. This is the winner, I would say. So this is most hard-boiled, uh, although it is not hard-boiled. And this comes from the US Flemish Russian heater. So I am a bit surprised, but maybe also this is due 
that this bag was the smallest and it was uh, it had the best contact with this heating pad. The Canadian ones, I didn't peel this egg because as you can see this is almost liquid so this is not boiled actually fully. It is just transparent inside, just raw, this egg white. And the Ukrainian was really powerful but you can see it is also soft boiled but I can eat it this is uh, uh, this is good for eating so I can cut, cut it but it will just you know flow um, out of the egg but let's let's have it no it was a good idea this is actually hard boiled or semi hard boiled egg but this one Uh, the heat was not distributed evenly, you can see, but the egg center is boiled. Here you have something like uh, more soft boiled. Anyway, you can boil an egg using flameless Russian heater, maybe not very perfect, you cannot steer the process but it is possible to eat. Thank you for watching this small video and I hope to see you in the next reviews. Bye!